Hello, my name is Amir Shah Dabinti Muhammad Sati Zaman and my metric number is 1182870. So today I will share about uh, a cancelling strategy on JKG land berhad. So for introduction, JKG Land Berhad, formerly Keladi Maju Berhad, is a property holding and investment company based in Malaysia. Property development and oil palm agriculture are two of the company segment. For current earning, current earning aims to study the quality of a company's earning by looking at the company's latest earning growth. JKG Land is one of the companies in the real estate sector that show improvement on Bursa Malaysia. The company generated profit for two years in a row. This uh, positive revenue growth is a very good thing for the company. Uh, this means that JKG Land has no problem generating revenue. So here, there are a few ways to evaluate a company's earning. Here for JKG Land, uh, we will assess annual earning growth by looking at previous annual revenue. JKG Land's net income began to decline in 2018. In 2019, the company net income increased from 2.1 million ringgit Malaysia to RM 17.1 million and further increased in 2020 by RM 22.1 million. For JKG Land Berhad, here uh, is a bad news for this company because they are experiencing a downward trend in prices, but stock prices might go up or down easily. The demand and supply of the number uh, of share in the market is important to determine the price movement of a stock. The daily trading volume of JKG Land is less than the average trading volume of the stock for 3 months. If this trading volume is less than the average trading volume for 3 months, this means that investors' focus is still not fully focused on the company's share. In Leader and Legate, this Leader and Legate is for us to determine which stocks are more sensitive to respond to any news related to a particular industry. The movement of JKG Land's share price uh, is higher compared to the movement of the index of other property sectors company on Bursa Malaysia. Therefore, JKG Land's share can be categorized as a leader compared to its other listed competitors on Bursa Malaysia. Institutional investors certainly have a lineup of analysts who do in-depth research from a fundamental point of view before investing into the companies. It gives uh, confidence to other investors to invest elsewhere. As in depth study from institutional investors have already been made. It seems that in the list of top 10 major shareholders of JKG Land, all of them are made up of share of individually owned companies. Institutional investors certainly have a lineup of analysts who do in depth research from a fundamental point of view before investing into the companies. It gives uh, confidence to other investors to invest elsewhere. As in depth study from institutional investors have already been made. It seems that in the list of top 10 major shareholders of JKG Land, all of them are made up of share of individually owned companies. For the conclusion, based on the cancelling study that have been conducted on the real estate sector from this JKG land company, the final results show a relatively good performance. Clearly, uh, the investment is performing relatively well for investing. Based on a uh, checklist of 7 criteria cancelling, relatively good performance. Clearly, uh, the investment is performing relatively well for investing.